So hi you guys, I am on here to do a medical update. Well, not really an update. Um, some of you guys things that's been going on with me. I know I had told you guys that um, I haven't gone through a lot of stuff like with my body, like feeling sick and different things like that. So um, I'm just gonna get into, I'm going to really go into depth in depth what they found recently um so just to run up from all the things that's wrong for me i have high blood pressure type 2 diabetes um a severe anemic um gout neuropathy um severe case of sleep apnea which is something new they just found, but, um, I also have, sorry for me to remember sometimes, I also, well, the thing they found recently was, a uh, um, microadenoma, which is a tumor on my pituitary gland, and a lot of things that I'm having is because of that. Um, I also have vertigo, which makes me really dizzy, so I walk with a cane now, so, yeah, and the reason why I'm telling you guys this, I'm just going to go over, like, some of the signs and the symptoms. Some of the symptoms are kind of graphic, but, um, I was trying to pull out of videos on symptoms of what they just diagnosed me with and I did find a couple of cases and trying to see like what's the next step for me so for this video I'm going to talk about that the the um, microadenoma so the reason why I wanted to go get checked out was because um, I go to the doctor all the time I'm always at the doctor um, once a week, I get um, iron infusions. I've been doing that for the last past two and a half years. Um, I'll do six weeks on and then have a week or two off. Um, they finally got my blood up to a level where it's not so severe. But I still have to do that and I get P12 shots. So the reason why they said that... Um, well, I'm not really going to get into that. I'm going to make another video on why I'm severe anemic. So, um, but it's pituitary. So, I had a lot of vision problems. Um, I wear glasses, as you guys know. Um, so, that was one thing. And then, I just thought that was associated with my vision. And then, um, sex sex is very it has become very 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 painful and that's like a big side effect of it I didn't know the pituitary gland had so many effects on you but they say everyone has it but it doesn't grow like it doesn't grow when it start growing and pressing on that nerve then that's when it becomes a problem so um, and the taste I my all my food everything i eat normally tastes weird it don't it don't taste like i remember like when i was younger and stuff like that so that was one thing and also the memory i um i some like my mom used to say like you all over the place like i'll say one thing and i'll you know go back and do another i've seen it in some of my videos once i'm editing and i edit it out and i'm like why would i just go over there but that's why and then um, my periods. <clears throat> I know I'm going to have nice, you know, regular periods. They, but it wasn't regular. They were like, I last three days. So that's like, after I had my tube ligation, I normally had three day periods. So it's been fine. It would come on, be fine. And for the last, last two to three months, they would come on and it would be like three months. Um, well, not really three months, like a whole month of bleeding and then I'll come then it'll come off like a week and then the next one come and I'll come on and stay on the whole month 
So I was losing a lot of blood like that and me being a severe anemic, that's definitely not good for me. So that was a sign and um, I have insurance, but they don't cover a lot, a lot of stuff. So some stuff I do have to come out of pocket with and so um, I'm on like for all of my sickness I'm on like 18 different medications which is a lot of medications for somebody being I still consider myself so young I'll only be 40 in December December 13th I'll be 40 and I've been having these problems for a long time so mostly all the medicines I'm taking make me sleepy they make me tired and um, it's hard for me to do things like that that's why I normally do my videos three or four times through I make a video like if you see my video I make those like at least three or four videos a day so that way if I don't have the energy or can't get out of bed then I'll have those on backup but so they ordered a, um, a cat scan so I did a CAT scan and um, they saw it on the CAT scan so I had to go in and do an MRI. So I did the MRI and I just got my results back when was it, Monday and they said they, they see it but they couldn't see how big it was because I didn't take the contrast because I'm allergic to iodine. So they would have to give me the contrast which I'm scared to get because I don't want to um, have allergic reactions the last thing I want and break out or you know something like that so I'm gonna have to go back in and do it with the contrast um, so my doctor is sending me to a brain uh, a brain special not a brain specialist but somebody that will be able to do the surgery because I definitely want it out and they're trying to see the size of it if they can go through my nose and get it out or would they have to cut my head I really don't want them to cut my head and you guys, if you know anything about this, please leave in the comments below. Like, if you know anybody that went through this and stuff like that. And also, I don't know if my Medicaid will cover it all. But I'm definitely thinking of doing something. I don't like to ask people for handouts and stuff like that. But I would probably, like, do a raffle or something like that for, like, a diamond painting or, you know, something else. <clears throat> if anybody want to donate a dollar or something like like donate anything um, I think I'm going to do a raffle but I'm not going to put a price on the raffle ticket so yeah I'm just I'm a little scared you know a lot of people that I haven't told a lot of people but I guess a lot of people know now because I was praying and hoping that it's just it would not be there um but I know when my son he's I don't make this video so many times you guys and I keep deleting it because I don't want to really cry you as you guys know I'm a very happy upbeat person I don't like to be sad but this is kind of sad and being that it's the holidays um it's pretty sad and the only thing I keep thinking about is my son how he see me you know sometimes so drowsy from that medication and have to go back and forth to the doctor and I was in the hospital for a week and that's a whole nother video and all he kept telling me was that he was so scared because he don't want me to die and y'all don't know how that feels to let your child look at you I know he's 16 but he's still my baby and to let him look at you and be like mom I don't want you to die like I need you and I'm just trying to do all I can to get better I am losing weight um every time I go I have lost a lot of weight um I started out at 502 pounds you guys I don't even know how I got to 502 pounds but right now I am at 310 so I am trying to get this weight off but it is pretty hard you know like my doctor tell me you didn't put it on overnight don't stress yourself out because it's not gonna leave overnight but I am trying to do all I can I haven't been released to exercise yet but as soon as I do 
You better believe I'm going to get me a membership, a gym membership or something like that. So, yeah, I just want to tell you guys about this. Of course, I'll be making a series of videos um, and let you guys know what happened, like, um, like what's going on. So, I guess now I'm going to start with a raffle. You guys can cash at me if you want to help me with my medical fund um the raffles it don't matter if you guys send me any money it don't matter if it's 50 cents if you guys send me something you automatically enter into the raffle i'm going to give it about um a month before i pull a car before i pull and um, you guys, I just want to thank you in advance for anybody that donated. And if you don't donate it, just by you watching these videos and leaving comments and thumbs up in them, that's helping me out too, you guys. Um, I can't thank you guys enough. I am scared because I never had to go through this. Um, like this process, I have had surgeries, but not like that I had two c-sections and I got my tubes tied but that's about it but nobody messing around with my in my head I really I really am scared about that so if you guys know anything about this or if you know what I should be asking the questions I should be asking or anything like that or if you guys have more questions about um, my doctor's appointments and things like that <coughs> like whether they're saying stuff like that things I should be asking my doctor I really would like to know um but yeah you guys continue to pray for me thank you so much you guys I love you guys so much it's nice to have somebody to talk to um and I'm gonna get through this I have too much faith not to so yeah you guys my cash app is the cash symbol I'm going to try to put it down here. It's a cash symbol, Caressa's Charms. Anything that you donate is like so, so, so appreciated. Um, I will keep you guys updated on the process that I'm going through. I really didn't want to be one of those vloggers that have to tell this kind of stuff because it's sad. But this is life things happen you can look at someone and you'll never know what they're going through in their life or you'll never know like <clears throat> the things that they've been through and I definitely don't like to be sad I always like to be happy and uplifting and uplifting others but I'm kind of scared right now and I do need you guys to pray and send out your love so I'm going to start with the raffles um, today. Well, yeah. When you guys see this video, I'll start with the raffles. And when you send a cash app, make sure you put that you want in to the raffle. Uh, you can donate a dollar. You can be a dollar a ticket. And you guys can donate whatever you want. But I thank you in advance. And I'm sorry to bring sad news. But, um yeah that's what I'm dealing with I know I've been telling you guys a long time but that's that's the process we're at now I have other stuff going on but I'm gonna make that for a separate video because I can only upload 15 minutes with the new editor I have so thank you guys thank you so much thank you have a good day like share subscribe and love these videos bye